In Utah, every business starts with their own story. And the same is true for Salsa Queen. But first, what is Salsa Queen? We make gourmet salsas, Mexican salsas and dips. Sounds delicious. Mmm. So, who is the Salsa Queen? I'm the Salsa Queen, and I actually legally changed my name to Salsa Queen. You really changed your name to Salsa Queen? We love the dedication. So, why did you start your business? One thing that I started as creating a small business just to support my family, now we have created a lot of opportunities for other people to work with us. But we have come long ways. You sure have. I love your logo. What's the story behind that? So my firstborn, he passed away of leukemia. So out of love and respect for him, we have chosen the Sugar Skull, which represents Day of the Dead that we, you know, celebrate with a lot of love and honor. Ah, oh, I love that story. What is your advice for any aspiring women entrepreneurs out there? My advice for them is to create something around a passion that they have to surround themselves with people that they can help them to grow. When you surround yourself with the right people, you can grow tremendously. Nobody had ever believed in me. And when I met Jim, he was the first person that asked me, what would you like to do? So because he believed in me, the sky was the limit. With no education, being dyslexic, you know, having a lot of being a minority, being a woman, and to be where I'm at, standing right here in front of you guys. I mean, everything is possible. I get teary-eyed, I guess. You're going to make us cry too. Quick, what's one last pearl of wisdom? I built this company with $3,000. So if I didn't, so can you. Queen, you're a real inspiration. Thanks for sharing your story with us. Find more inspirational stories at inutah.org.